Electricity is a form of energy. It's all around us, even though we can't see it directly. Think of the lights in your house or the power that runs your TV. That's electricity at work. Electricity is a bit mysterious, but it's based on the way tiny particles move and interact. These particles, called electrons, are much too small to see, but when they start flowing, they create a current of electricity, and this flow of electricity is what powers our world. Without it, we'd be living in the Dark Ages, literally. So let's dive in and learn a little more about this amazing force. To understand electricity, we need to talk about atoms. Atoms are like tiny building blocks that make up everything around us. Inside an atom, even tinier particles are moving around. One of these particles is called an electron, and it carries a negative charge. Think of electrons like tiny marbles buzzing around the center of an atom. Sometimes these electrons can jump from one atom to another. When electrons move from atom to atom in a flow, we call that an electric current. This flow of electrons is what gives electricity its power. It's like a river of tiny charges moving through a wire, ready to do work. Where does all this electricity come from? Well, we can't just scoop it out of the air, although thunderstorms give us a hint. We have to generate electricity using different sources of energy. One common source is power plants. Some power plants burn fossil fuels like coal or natural gas to create steam, which spins turbines to generate electricity. Other power plants use the energy of flowing water in dams or the power of the sun with solar panels. Each method of generating electricity has its pros and cons, but they all achieve the same goal, getting those electrons flowing to provide us with power. We use electricity for so many things in our daily lives. When you flip a light switch, you're completing a circuit, which allows electricity to flow through the wires and light up the bulb. The same principle applies to your phone charger, your computer, your refrigerator and countless other devices. Electricity can also be used to power motors, which are found in everything from electric cars to washing machines. It can also generate heat, like in your toaster or electric oven. Electricity is an essential part of modern life. Understanding the basics of how it works helps us appreciate its importance and use it safely and responsibly.